So here I am at Cafe Coffee Shop Baristello here in the Jerry Street in Montreal where they make fantastic hot coffees or even sometimes cold coffees. And if you want the coffee to go, you buy the bags for the beans. And are you, are you hungry? Do you want to eat it? Because he also makes fantastic sandwiches every day fresh. So you can eat it today or you can even heat it up and eat it after if you want. I don't care what you do with your in life. Here I am today doing an inside look I'm going to look inside of the cafe, cafe coffee shop, Baristello, with the owner here, Piero. Hi. Hello. Thank you for letting uh, us to do it here. Um, I have to ask you one question. I don't. I don't even drink coffee. So what do you have to say to to get the customer to come inside to have it hot coffee? What do you say to that? Good morning. Oh, that's to say hello. Yes. What if it comes after that? What if it comes uh, around uh, 12 o'clock? Well, good morning or good afternoon. Okay, that's very so very polite here at the Baristello. Would you say that the Baristello means that you are barista? Correct. Is that like the companies, you know the company Big Coffee? They make big coffee shops. They're Tim Norton's, Dunkin' Donuts. What do you say about those companies? Uh, they're amazing. Uh, big corporation. You know, we're more family. They're more family. Yes. Less big. Smaller. Yes. Like espresso. <laughs> like at the s espresso. But espresso, you can have it smaller. You can have it uh, also bigger. Correct. Right? Yes. Can you show us how, uh, how would you go ahead and do one? Yes, sir. All right. All right. First, you empty... The port filter. Empty the port into the 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 drawer. Knock box. Knock. I'm sorry. Knock box. Okay. And why do we knock it to see what what's why why we do that for? Knock the coffee into the box. Okay. Give it a, a hard knock on the box. Can we do that? So you can hear a hard pyros knocking that box. Then. This is the grinder. The beans grinds into the portafilter. Okay, so you're going to grind ports into you're going to grind it onto the filter. Yeah, kind of. The beans are they uh a lot of people say what kind of beans can you put any any beans you want on there? Yeah, you could put uh South American beans. Uh you could put Ethiopian beans, Brazilian, Costa Rican, Ethiopian. It's strictly for co only beans for coffee. We Correct. don't know other. A lot of vegans eat beans. Uh, can you grind uh, edamame beans? Can you grind chickpeas? No, just coffee beans. Just for coffee. Yeah. Okay. So for the watchers, they don't have to get something else to do that. Okay. Then we grind. Then you tamp. Tap it. Yes. yes. Right, okay. So we take the cup, put it here. Do you put it here so you can fa you get fast? No, we keep it there because it keeps the ceramic hot. And what if I want to fire on the drink f cold? Yeah, it's not the same cup. It's not the same process. Okay. okay. So it's very different. Yes. Like... Uh, uh, night time and daytime, a very different time. Yeah, put the cup here, press the button. How many buttons do you push? One. All right. Oh my. This is a hot coffee. Does it take like 10 years for all of it to come out? About 20 seconds, 25 if you want to be precise. That's pretty fast, actually. That's wonderful. So, Piero, you said you wake up in the morning one time and you said, I'm going to open up my cafe coffee shop. What is in your head on you? What do you say, what do you say to yourself? Well, basically, I wanted to share an experience, experience of um, what we grew up with. Um, after dinner, we have a coffee, we have cookies, so you can cook it before or after dinner to exp to experience. 
yeah, you could do that um, and uh, basically continue the evening, you know, socializing. And if uh, someone says, I'm going to do it, I'm going to open my shop, my cafe coffee, what do you say to that, to someone who says, I want to think to do it? Um, it's a good experience, um, but make sure you find the right spot, right area. Spot it out. Yeah, spot it out. Uh, location, location, location. Um, Wait, where? Location. Okay. Which which one? Um, any location that's good for you. We have this inside. This is we're looking inside Piro. Yeah. Which in where do you want to locate it? Um, Montreal. Okay, that's a good answer. So. It, uh, Sometimes you wake up and you say to yourself, oh, f no, I don't feel any motivation today. What do you say to go and do it? Uh, stay in mind. You just do it because you do it for everybody else. Make people happy with that one small cup of coffee. State your mind with the small coffees. There's one, one tips from Piro. Is there any other, call them pearls of wisdom, to pearl it for people who want to know how to do their dreams and the, and the pieces you want to say um pearls like beans yeah and it beans anything just follow your heart follow your dreams you know do the best you can believe in yourself believe it yeah. and believe in your product and the products so that's about all the time we have here with piero at the baristello coffee coffee shop and uh, been around for Ages and ages, about 40 years now. and mm, Three years. All right, so about three years. Still, uh, perceptionally speaking, very long time. And uh, thank you for your time, Piero. Thank you very You're much. Welcome. Thank you. Thank you.